Hello everyone, my name is Excalibeard, and welcome back. Today I have a little surprise for you. It's called air pressure. Yeah, air pressure. And if you can't hear any music in the background, neither can I. That's because uh, the music is, the only music is in-game. And this, if you've never heard of this game, which if you haven't been to Newgrounds, you probably haven't, it's a trip. Uh, I still haven't quite figured it out yet. I just did it once, and it's from what I hear, it's a game that you have to play like multiple times, but it takes only a short amount of time to do it each time, and you unravel the story more and more of the story each time you go through it. Um, so yeah, let's dive on. Let's dive right in, shall we? I met her when I was a teenager. From the second we met, she wrapped herself around my left arm and was stuck there ever since. It's several years later now. She's still here with me. L how do you pronounce that? Lay? How's it going? Not sure how I feel about her being around anymore. Fine. That's good. Hey, do you know what day it is? It's the anniversary of the day we met! Of course it is. So, do you want to do anything? Huh? Uh, how about... Let's be nice to her. Let's just stay in. Let's just... Stay in together. You sure? That's a little boring. Really, this anniversary doesn't mean that much to me. It's just another day. Excuse me? I I was trying to be nice. And so she's saying I'm going out by myself. And that's what said I'm going out, right? Anyways. I mean I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I forgot it was coming up. Ha! Huh, don't worry. Memory is strange. This date always seems to fall out of my head. But I remember other things about that day. Like the song which was playing when we met. Is it this song? Is this the song? It'd really be cool. It makes me feel a little nostalgic. Are you sure you're alright? Oh yeah, I was just thinking. About the day we met. About the day we met. Oh really? Yes. I was thinking how much has changed since we met. Haha. <laughs> I hope it's good change. Actually, thinking back to how it was before we met, I realized I was much happier then. Is staying here with her really such a good idea? Come on, man! She's your girl. Yeah. Yes. My life is different than I could have ever imagined. But now, I'm so comfortable with her that I can't imagine anything else. This is weird. Maybe life was better before, but I can't say that life after her would be any better than it is right now. Perhaps if we work together, we can make our lives better. Perhaps, yeah. A couple of hours passed. I started to get this nagging feeling. Hey. Hmm. I was wondering. Do you like me? Do you like me? Haha, <laughs> what a weird question. Of course I do. But why? Why shouldn't I? I'm ashamed to admit that I'm a little paranoid about this. I don't know. I think... It's not a good choice, is it? Um, I'm not a very nice person. Humble brag. I'm not a very nice person. It's not very brag, it's just humble. You seem nice to me. Hmm. Besides, you can rely on me to keep you nice. Huh? Is that what I really rely on her for? 
Is that all I get out of being with her? <laughs> Those are two separate questions, man! Yes, I hate to admit it. I'm just using her to reflect back myself. Selfishly without her. I wouldn't have any way to offer any guilt or unpleasant feelings I have. What is this? She seems to think that I'm not a bad person. But am I really a good person? As long as I doubt her, I can't get closer to her. This story, you see what I'm saying? This story is messed up. It's like... It's like, you know, I'm trying to have a good relationship with this girl, and this, it's like... It's just forcing this relationship to seem awkward. Uh, I'm wondering, though, because it's, it's a curious story, and it seems like it's going somewhere. It was the day after her anniversary. The heck? I had a dull sense of pressure in my head. Is that just... Can you, you guys can see that, right? Where it's, where she's kind of glitching out. It felt like I was surrounded. <laughs> what the heck? Hey. Uh, hey. Hmm? I was thinking. For a change? <laughs> Are you happy? Sure, I'm okay. Are you not happy? No, I'm just... I want us to be closer. We're gonna be closer than we are. I guess so. I always left it up to you. If you're sure that's what you want, I am. Wait. I knew it. It's fine, never mind. Something stopped me. I think I'm still afraid. I can't trust her, not completely. I think I made the right decision. I think we can stay together like this forever. Maybe we won't be happy, but I know we won't be sad. When it comes down to it, I'm too scared to be with her, or without her. I can be satisfied with a comfortable life. I don't need any answers or solutions. I think we can stay like this forever. So that's one ending! This game does have multiple endings, right? Because... Quit the Dom! Okay! So that's one ending. Um... What the heck? Okay, I'm starting to think that she's not real. That's my guess right now. I mean, you saw how she was glitchy, and I don't think that that was a glitch. I think that that was in-game. I think that was supposed to happen. So, um... Yeah, I think we have enough time for one more ending. Let's... Let's, uh, let's see what's going on. I met her when I was a teenager. I'm just going to be straight as nice as I can to her from now on. Like, even if I'm a little curious, I'm just going to see what happens. Um, here, let's skip ahead to where we were. Yeah, let's just, uh... I'm going to fast forward real quick to where we were before. One, two, three. We're back! Alright, um... Here's the place where it's the day after the anniversary. And we're gonna just be straight up nice, no matter how weird everything seems. Let's do this. Dove sense of pressure in my head. Felt like I was surrounded. Hey. Hmm? I was thinking. For a change. Uh, are you happy? Sure, I'm happy. I'm okay, I mean. Dang it. Are you not happy? No, I'm just... I want us to be closer. I always left it up to you. If you're sure that's what you want, I'm... I'm sure. Yes, I'm sure of it. Hold still. Hold still. I couldn't stand it anymore. I didn't want to stay the same forever. I wanted to make a decision, even if it was a reckless one. I know I made the right decision. Nurse! You're lucky. You're lucky this time! <laughs> what? As if I would be that stupid. What? Wait. When can I go home? You 
you have to wait to see the doctor in the morning and we'll see you there. Right. Do you feel better now? Yes. So why did you do it? Of course, it was no problem to talk my way out of the hospital. It was easy, because I honestly never felt so good. I felt complete. I should never have doubted that I needed her. At the end of the day, my flaws are as defining as my good qualities. I need her to carry on my being myself, to sustain my personality. I need her to be happy. She's not real. She's... I'm gonna be... told jerk to her because I think I know who she is. I think I know what she is. Let's start from the beginning real quick and just go through all the being jerk to her because I don't think she's a person. The hospital. This is a cool way to tell a story. Uh, this, I think she's drugs. Or actually, hitting bangs or arteries. I think that she is self-inflicted wounds incarnate. Um, from the second we met, she wrapped herself around my left arm and has stuck there ever since, like a scar. Oh my goodness. It's several years later now. She's still here with me. How's it going? I think... Yes. I'm not sure how I felt about her being around anymore. Fine. That's good. Hey, do you know what day it is? It's the anniversary of the day we met. Of course it is. So, do you want to do anything? Huh? How about... I'm going out. I think I'm just going to go on for a walk. Uh, okay. I thought I would head out into town for a while. There's busy people everywhere. I wanted to get lost among the crowd for a while. Maybe even feel like a normal person for a bit. But then, I hear someone. So, carry on. I think I know who it is. I don't stop walking. Oi! Are you ignoring me? You are, aren't you? Uh... Hey! I want to be alone. I'm sorry. Right, whatever. What are you doing here anyway? I'm just gonna be a total jerk because I, I am pretty sure that she is not a good thing. Why are you here? Stupidly, I thought you needed me. Clearly, I am wrong. Hmm. Yeah, you are wrong. I don't need you. What an idiot. I am. I am. <laughs> Can't talk. <laughs> Sorry. What an idiot I am. She walked away in a huff. And I'm an idiot because I followed her. I walked beside her. Oh. Now I'm going after her? No, no, no. Well, a little behind her, too. She's quiet. Probably annoyed with Stay silent. I'm not apologizing. <laughs> Grr! Are you going to say anything? I can't think of anything. Heh! <laughs> I'm tired. I don't want to help you anymore. You rely on me too much. I don't care. Oh, really? Say so you would be fine if I stopped helping you completely? You wouldn't. Heh! <laughs> you think you can get by without me to back you up? Well... Yes! Well, I would like to try. <laughs> and come running to me when you fail. Not if you're... <laughs> not if you're... Not if you're not going to help. Not if you're not going to help. Dang it. Can't word today. <gasps> Don't be like that. You know I'll always help you. No matter how bad things seem. We argued a little more on the way home. I think I'm realizing that I don't want her around. She can threaten me with leaving, but I think she's more scared of it than I am. We need to talk. But that's never good. Can't we just carry on as always? It's alright, isn't it? No. Sorry. We can't do this anymore. Heh. <laughs> I don't believe you. She's... I'm... I'M WINNING THE GAME! 
She's disappearing! I'm winning the game. I'm going to do this. I know you. You're useless without me. Just empty, boring like everyone else. I don't know which one to choose in order to press the right decision! Let's go this one. What? Hey, you don't want to be like everyone else, right? They can't possibly understand you, and if they find out about me, they'll hate you for sure. You've heard what they say, haven't you? Shut up! No, what will you do when you realize they hate you? If I am not around, who's going to make all that matter, not matter. You know I'm what makes you yourself. I know. I hate that. It doesn't have to be bad. Please? Can I- Was that not right? I gave in! How did I give in? I think- <sighs> I'll be right back. Why was that? I'll be right back. Ready? Alright, we're back. Yeah. I'm gonna make up my mind instead. Ah. Uh, mouse. Mouse, stay with me, mouse. Oh no, no, my mouse is going crazy. Okay. I made up my mind. Ha ha ha. I doubt it. You're too scared. Without me around, you can't do anything! Who else is going to help you? No one! Make her leave. I don't care. You have to go. No one can help you. Not as much as I can! You have to go. Part of me agreed with her. All those things she said. Of course. I knew I couldn't let myself believe her anymore. I hope I made the right decision. She was out of my life within a month. I no longer rely on her. I've gained my independence. I'm happy now. The future feels uncertain, but I'm excited to be free. I hope the day will come when I want to see her. When I wait, I hope the day will never come when I want to see her again. All right. So this was air pressure. I think that was the. I think I won. That was a little confusing. It's like, why is screaming at her different than just making up your mind? I mean, both are kind of the same thing in my mind. But, yeah, I mean, this is this is a serious um, topic. Uh, I didn't realize we were going to get, like, really dark with this. But, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, it's real talk. This type of story, you know... Addiction, you know, a lot of people um, deal with addiction in one way, shape, or form, and, uh, you know, I, I've, I have two, um, and it takes a lot, it takes a lot of willpower, and to be honest with you, for me, it took a lot of help from the outside. If you don't, but if you don't have anyone, I can only imagine how much more difficult that would be. It's, it's um. And when I say addiction, I'm not like, you know, people get like drink alcohol and just get a little, you know, happy off of it or get a little drunk. That's not really what I'm talking about. I'm talking about like getting addicted to a certain substance or a certain thing that takes control of your life. That stuff, that, and it doesn't really matter what it is, something that takes control of your life like that, you gotta break free. And if you can't do it yourself, then I urge, I urge you to get help. I and mean, that's what I had to do, is I had, I had to reach out and you know, ask for help. And it was still a long road. 
But yeah, that was uh, kind of a point-and-click adventure story, like a choose-your-own-adventure type thing. And uh, it seems like there was only one way to get it right. There was, there was other endings, probably. But I just, uh, I'm going to stick with those three. Um, it wasn't what it seemed to be, that's for sure. It kind of, it, it went in a good direction. The music was, was, was okay. Obviously the graphics were pixelated, but they actually fit really well. Um, I liked it. I hope you guys did too. Um, I really do, because... Yeah. It's on Newgrounds if you want to play it. I'll try to figure out how to put a link in the description below. It's free. It's just, you know, you play it. And uh, I will see you all in the next video. Salute.